Introduction We have learnt about decimals in our previous classes. We know that 50 rupees 75 paise, 3 meter 5 centimeter, 4 kg 500 gram etc. can be written using decimals as rupees 50.75, 3.05 meter, 4.500 kg etc. Decimal Fraction The fraction in which the denominators are 10, 100, 1000 etc. are known as decimal fractions. Example, 4 by 10, 37 by 100, 428 by 1000 etc. These decimal fractions can be written as 0.4. 0 0.37, 0 0.428, etc. A decimal has two parts, whole number part and decimal part. These two parts are separated by dot, called as decimal point. Place value table We are already familiar with the place value table. We know that in a place value system, when we move one place from right to left, its place value becomes 10 times. In the same way, moving a digit from left to right, its place value becomes 1 tenth. Extending the place value table from left to right beyond one's place gives rise to decimals. Thus, we can extend the place value chart as lakh, ten thousand, thousand, hundreds, tens, ones, one tenth. Representation of decimals on number line. How to represent 0 0.7 on number line? We know that 0 0.7 is greater than 0 but less than 1. So, it lies between 0 and 1. Now, 0 0.7 can be written as 7 by 10. So, we divide the gap between 0 and 1 into 10 equal parts and take 7 part as 0 0.7 or 7 by 10 as shown in figure. Representation of 1.4 on number line We know that 1.4 lies between 1 and 2. So, we divide the gap between 1 and 2 into 10 equal parts and take fourth part to represent 1.4. Point P represents 1.4. Example 1. Write the given decimals in place value chart. 3254.8 Solution Thousands, Hundreds, Tens, Ones, Tenth, Three, Two, Five, Four, Eight. Example 2 Write the following as decimal A. 27 and 3 by 10 B. 600 plus 2 plus 8 by 10. Solution A. 27 and 3 by 10 is equal to 27 plus 0.3 which is equal to 27.3. B. 600 plus 2 plus 8 by 10 is equal to 602 plus 0.8 which is equal to 602.8. 100th When one whole is divided into 100 equal parts and one part is shaded, then it is 1 by 100th of the whole. 15 by 100 means 15 parts out of 100 parts are shaded. 8 by 100 means 8 parts out of 100 parts are shaded. To represent 1 by 100 in place value table, we place 100th to the right of 10th place as shown. Thousands, hundreds, tens, ones, tenths, hundredths.
Remember, digits after decimals are read individually. Example, 3.35 is read as 3.35, not as 3.35. Example 1. Write the block information using A. Place value chart and B as decimal. Solution A. Place value table. Hundreds, tens, ones, tenths, hundredths. One, three, five, one, five. B. In decimal form, the block information can be written as 135.15. Example 2. Write the following fractions as decimal. A. 4 by 5. B. 3 by 4. C. 9 by 1000. Solution. A. 4 by 5 is equal to 4 into 2 by 5 into 2, which is equal to 8 by 10, which is equal to 0 0.8. B. 3 by 4 is equal to 3 into 25 by 4 into 25, which is equal to 75 by 100, which is equal to 0 0.75. C. 9 by 1000 is equal to 0 0.009. Example 3. Write the given decimals as fractions in lowest form. A. 148.32 B. 200.812 Solution A. 148.32 is equal to 14,832 by 100, which is equal to 7,416 by 50, which is equal to 3,708 by 25. B. 200.812 is equal to 2,812 by 1,000, which is equal to 1,406 by 500, which is equal to 50,203 by 250. Example 4. Write each of the following as decimal. A. 200 plus 30 plus 5 plus 2 by 10 plus 9 by 100. B. 70 plus 4 by 10 plus 5 by 100. Solution. A. 200 plus 30 plus 5 plus 2 by 10 plus 9 by 100 is equal to 235.29. B. 70 plus 4 by 10 plus 5 by 100 is equal to 70.45. Example 5. Write the following decimals in words. A. 0 0.06 B. 4.57 Solution A. 0 decimal 0 0.06 B. 4 decimal 57 Comparison of decimals Rule for comparison of two decimals Step 1 First, we compare the whole number parts. The decimal having greater whole part is greater. Step 2. If whole parts are equal, then we compare tenth part. The decimal with greater tenth is greater. Step 3. If tenth parts are also equal, then we compare hundredths part. The decimal part having greater hundred is greater and so on. Example, compare the following decimals. A. 7.35 and 9.15 B. 3.45 and 3.56 C. 2.467 and 2.468 Solution A. 7.35 or 9.15 Compare the whole part of 7.35 and 9.15. 7 is less than 9. So, 7.35 is less than 9.15. B. 3.45 or 
compare the whole part of 3.45 and 3.56 3 is equal to 3 so we compare tenth part of 3.45 and 3.56 because 4 is less than 5 so 3.56 is greater than 3.45 c 2.467 or 2.468 Compare the whole part of 2.467 and 2.468. 2 is equal to 2. They are same. So, we compare tenth part of 2.467 and 2.468. 4 is equal to 4. Now, we will compare hundredth part of 2.467 and 2.468. 6 is equal to 6. Hundredth part is also same. So, we compare thousandth part. 7 is less than 8. Hence, 2.467 is less than 2.468. Conversion of units Length To convert smaller units into bigger units, we divide by the number of smaller units present in one bigger unit. That is, we know that 100 cm is equal to 1 meter. So, to convert 20 cm into meter, we divide. 20 divided by 100 or 20 by 100 is equal to 0 0.2 meter. 20 cm is equal to 0 0.2 meter. We know that 1000 meter is equal to 1 kilometer. So, 40 meter is equal to 40 by 1000 kilometer, which is equal to 0 0.04 kilometer. Money. We know that 100 paise is equal to 1 rupee. So, 1 paise is equal to rupee 1 by 100 or rupee 0 0.01. And 65 paise is equal to rupee 65 by 100, which is equal to rupee 0 0.65. Weight. We know that 1000 gram is equal to 1 kilogram. 1 gram is equal to 1 by 1000 kilogram. 500 gram is equal to 500 by 1000 kilogram which is equal to 0 0.5 kilogram. Similarly, 2350 gram is equal to 2350 by 1000 kilogram which is equal to 2.350 kilogram or 2.35 kilogram. Like and unlike decimals. Decimals having the same number of decimal places are called as like decimals. Example 2.35, 6.57, 3.42, etc. are like decimals. Decimals having different decimal places are called as unlike decimals. Example 2.3 and 6.34 are unlike decimals. Unlike decimals can be converted to like decimals by adding zeros after the last digit of decimal part so as to make their decimal parts equal. Addition and Subtraction of Like and Unlike Decimals Rules for Addition and Subtraction a. Change the given decimals to like decimals. B. Write the numbers in place value chart or arrange in columns in such a way that the digits of same place are in same columns. C. Add or subtract the numbers in column from the rights the same way as we carry the normal addition or subtraction. Example 1. Add the following. 280.69 plus 25.2 plus 38. Solution. 25.2 has only one decimal place. So, we will add one zero to make it like decimal. That is 25.20. 38 has no decimal part. So, it can be written as 38.00. 280.69 25.20 plus 38.00 is equal to 
343.89. Example 2. Subtract 105.75 from 912. Solution. To make 912 as like decimal, we will add two zeros to it after the decimal. 912.00 minus 105.75, which is equal to 806.25. Example 3. Subtract 3.895 from 75.2. Solution 75.200 minus 3.895 is equal to 71.305. Example 4 Rashid spent Rs. 35.75 for mathematics book and Rs. 32.60 for science book. Find the total amount spent by Rashid. Solution Cost of mathematics book is equal to Rs. 35.75. Cost of science book is equal to Rs. 32.60. Total cost is equal to Rs. 35.75 plus Rs. 32.60. So, Rs. 35.75 plus Rs. 32.60 is equal to Rs. 68.35. Total amount spent by Rashid is Rs. 68.35. Example 5. Rani had Rs. 48.50. She bought an ice cream for Rs. 20.50 and a chocolate for Rs. 10.50. Find the amount left with her. Solution. Cost of ice cream is equal to Rs. 20.50. Cost of chocolate is equal to Rs. 10.50. Total cost is equal to Rs. 20.50 plus Rs. 10.50 which is equal to Rs. 31. Total money Rani had is equal to Rs. 48.50. Money spent is equal to Rs. 31.00. Money left is equal to Rs. 48.50 minus 31. Rs. 48.50 minus Rs. 31.00 is equal to Rs. 17.50. Thus, Rs. 17.50 is left with her.